When white people show you a white Jesus who came from the tribe of Judah and Judah married a black woman being a Canaanite and Genesis 9:18 states all day long that Ham, the father of the black race, was the father of Canaan's Canaanites, then you know they're lying on other subjects. Let's take it from the beginning. The Bible states that the Garden of Eden began in Africa. Okay? The Bible states that the Garden of Eden began in Africa. Let's look at it. The Bible states in Genesis chapter 2, verses 9 through 12, Out of the ground the Lord God made every tree grow that is pleasant to the eye, the tree of the knowledge of good and evil. Here we go, verse 10. A river went out of Eden to water the garden, and it parted and became four rivers. The name of the first one, which surrounds the whole land of Havilah, where there is gold. Let me show you where Havilah is, people. It's the first name of a black man in scripture. This was Ham's grandson named Havilah. Okay, his father's name was Ethiopia. Okay? Havilah today is called the Sudan. It used to be called Nubia, which means what? Land of gold. What does it say about Havilah in the Bible, the word of truth? Havilah, where there is gold. Nubia means land of gold. And guess what? The gold of that land is good. Let's go on down to chapter 2, verse 13 in the King James Bible. And it states that the second river for the Garden of Eden was Gihon. And it surrounded the whole land of what? Ethiopia. Guess where Ethiopia is? White people will say, the ancient Near East. As they say, the Egypt was the ancient Near East. They'll never tell you that Egypt was in North Africa. Why? Because Europeanized Christianity is nothing but veiled white racism. Okay? Go to the Bible and get biblical black history. Go to the Bible and get biblical Christianity, not Europeanized Christianity. That's why you need this book. Again, it's as big as an encyclopedia. It's 670 pages illustrated. It's called The Complete History of Blacks in the Bible. Now, white people will tell you that the Garden of Eden is in Iraq. Look it up on the images in Google. They will only show you Iraq. They will never show you that the Bible states that one of its rivers surrounded the whole land of Ethiopia and the other river surrounded the whole land of Havla. The Garden of Eden stretched from here to here. Get this book on Amazon.com and believe on Jesus and be saved.